Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to another video. I am the Pretty Girl Investor, your favorite wealth coach. I teach you how to invest, grow, and create multiple streams of income. If you are new to this channel, hit that subscribe button, join the fam. There's nothing but bosses over here, so make yourselves at home. In today's video, we're gonna be talking about threads. I really wish I had a piece of thread right now, but I couldn't find one, so just pretend like you see my imaginary piece of thread. But yes, y'all, we're gonna be talking about threads. Twitter's rival app. Hmm, let's get into it. So I'm gonna be giving you all the tea and all the info about all I know about this Threads app so you can decide if you really wanna join this app or not. So Mark Zuckerberg, the creator of Facebook, has released a rival Twitter app on July 5th. It's an app similar, very similar to Twitter. And it has already surpassed 1 million users. It's only been two days. I'm really shocked this, this app was one of the fastest growing apps that I've ever seen. It is also charting at number one in the app store on iOS devices. It is number one guys within two days. So if you wanna get on Threads, here is a couple things that you should know first, okay? This is very vital. If you want to get on the Threads app, Threads is connected to your Instagram account it is connected connected so if you delete threads it will delete your instagram account so i'm going to just say that first because i feel like that is the most important part and i didn't know that before i went to go download threads yes i have a threads account so if you end up not liking threads or if you just find out like threads is taking up too much space threads isn't for you you don't really mess with the app like that. Well, too bad because if you're popping on Instagram, you might not want to delete that Threads account. Also, once your Instagram is linked to Threads, it will give you an ugly ID number on your Instagram account. Don't really know what the ID number is for, but all I know is Threads has something to do with it because once you pair your Threads and Instagram, there's ugly jumble of numbers will pop up on your Instagram account and ugh, it just looks like it's out of place and like it shouldn't be there. Another thing, the app is totally free to download. It is not like Twitter at all. You do not have to pay for anything as of yet anyway. You don't have to pay for anything at all. You can just use the app freely and you can see as many users, threads as you want to. I was about to say tweets. You can see as many threads as you want to without there being any type of limitations. And here's another thing I noticed. You can write up to 500 words per post. You can even post up to five minute long videos on threads. You can also repost people's threads just like Twitter. And you can also share your threads to your Instagram account and it will give you a cool thread background to let everybody know that you have a threads account. So I think that's pretty cool. So far to me, the app is new, it's refreshing. It gives a different type of vibe than Twitter. Everyone from your Instagram knows you cause you get to keep your same username. So it's just like everyone from Twitter migrating to a different area. It's really like its own group chat in a way. You get to talk and chat with your Instagram friends on a different type of app because Instagram isn't really a chatting app. It's more, it's more for pictures and videos, but you know, we're on a totally different app where it's, it's a lot of chatting going on. So it's like, oh, I get to really chat with my favorite influencers and my favorite gurus and it's, it's just really refreshing to have something like that. Everybody is starting from zero. Everybody is pretty much equal. And we're all just trying to figure out our way through this maze of threads. I've also seen some people say they're tired of seeing educational stuff. They just want a fun app. They just want to, to vibe. They don't want the same type of content they see on other apps on this app. But I just feel like it, it all depends on who you follow. If you follow someone that and all they talk about is education, what, what else do you think they're gonna talk about on a different type of platform? I mean, they might mix it up a little bit, but it's like, what else do you want from me? <laughs> I've seen a lot of people trying to figure out how to monetize the app already. A lot of people do not know how they wanna go about things and how they wanna monetize and make money off of this app. So I, I see a lot of people trying to figure that out. And also seeing people trying to see how much they can get away with on threads because on Twitter, you know, you couldn't say 
but so much worse before, you know, you would get blocked or you would get banned or your account would be disabled. So there's some people trying to test the water a little bit, but remember before you do that, if you're thinking about doing that, your threats account is connected to your Instagram account. So I don't know how that will work if your account was to get blocked. Will it put a temporary hold on your Instagram account too? You know, we just don't know. But there are a lot of unknowns as of yet because the app is still new. I would say it is a lot easier to get followers on this app than probably any other app because it's already connected to your Instagram account. It's already connected to your followers. So once you get on there, it's going to ask you, do you want to follow the people that you follow on Instagram or do you want to add these people that you follow on Instagram and you just say yes and accept and it will go ahead and add everybody that you follow already on Instagram. And the same thing, if someone follows you on Instagram, they will click add everybody and it will automatically send you a friend request because they added everybody and that's how you grow. That's how you get followers on thread. But how do y'all think Elon feels about all of this? Like, do y'all really think Elon is happy? I don't. I think he woke up and was just like, no. Like, <laughs> if I created an app and somebody came after my app and it was like 10 times better and it just launched, I would be like, <laughs> like I know he is very hot right now I just boy I wish I could have been a fly on the wall but y'all that is most of what I got from this threads app since it's just been released let me know if you plan on joining this threads app if you do make sure you follow your girl the pretty girl investor I am on threads follow me I follow back if you like this video don't forget to hit that subscribe button Share this video with your friends, anybody who's thinking about joining Threads. They need to know some of this information. And I will see you guys in my next video.